As management pioneer Warren Bennis observed, leaders do not avoid, repress, or deny conflict, but rather see it as an opportunity. Let's take a look at creating constructive conflict. Conflict is a disagreement that arises when two or more parties perceive a threat to their interests, needs, or concerns. Most people dislike conflict. It's seen as easier, less stressful, and less risky to one's career to avoid conflict and suppress dissenting opinions despite their effectiveness in stimulating more creative and effective ideas and solutions. Often, we're unsure of whether or not we're correct, and we also may fear ridicule or rejection. Yet organizations that avoid conflict will have an increasingly difficult time competing successfully in the global environment. So what can managers do to increase the positive outcomes of conflict? The creative, innovative, and very successful design firm IDEO has three rules for brainstorming. Concentrate on the quantity of ideas, don't criticize other ideas, and elaborate and build on other ideas. Rewarding employees who engage in constructive conflict can help reduce employees' fears of ridicule and rejection. A simple thank you for voicing a dissenting opinion can signal to employees that it's okay to speak up. Hiring employees who are comfortable with constructive conflict and who tend to use effective conflict management strategies can also enhance constructive conflict and improve organizational performance. Assigning one or more employees to pay the role of devil's advocate can help generate a constructive conflict. 